Hey guys, this is just a quick um, extra little episode and while I'm waiting for everyone to comment on the last video what they want to be and do um, I'll send over just a couple more bits in preparation so I'm actually sitting over this Salvation 2 ship here uh, because I had like around 11 new people to put in I'll say 11 as 8 <laughs> so yeah I sent I sent over in this Far Cry follower Solaris Jimmy Russells, Sentund, Yodu45, Master Brownie1, William Howe, I know you want a shack William, um, you'll get one soon, and Charles, so you eight are going over in this, but it doesn't quite go to plan, um, I didn't have my VTOL balance very well, and I also accidentally had, I, I say accidentally, I was testing things before, and um, yeah I had the unbreakable damage on and stuff so you guys probably should be dead but we actually make it just about I do um, switch it back on you'll see I guess so yeah I'm just going to actually play music because I don't really have much to say about it and I guess it would be better for you to just watch it although we're coming down now anyway so yeah I might as well stay with you guys uh, my live commentary will be back soon so yeah, I switched to the VTOLs, and because it's imbalanced, it started to tilt over. I think it's bottom heavy, yeah. Either that or the SAS is rubbish, but yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just bottom heavy. You see it, there you go, flipped over. So I switched to the uh, other engine quickly, but that didn't help. And then we should have blown up there, but I had the um, cheat part on where I was testing something before. I forgot to take it off, as you can see. So I was debating whether to turn it off or on and save it like this or not. But I turn it off and we lose the back engine in a sec. But yeah, you guys are safely down, just about. It's actually quite a funny little landing. So yeah, there you go, there goes the engine, and then you guys just bounce around and eventually land upright. There you go, so that's pretty fun. Nice and rocky. So yeah, that's Firecrow Follower, Solaris, Jimmy, Sentent, Yodu, Master Brownie, William Howe and Charles are in there. So I'll come and rescue you guys soon, and I'll sort out a better salvation ship, one that actually is balanced and works. I don't need the um, nuclear power on there, really. That's And yeah, I don't know, I'll sort it out anyway. So that's it. Uh, the winches still work. <laughs> but yeah, that's it now. Uh, my normal commentary will come back and, and that's pretty much it, yeah. So, bye. <laughs> Okay guys, so just the last, last little bit of preparation now. Um, Aragon built this frigate and it's pretty darn awesome. So I'm going to be using this. Uh, this is an enemy ship, just so you know. It's got a couple of lasers up the top here. It's actually really cool. You can shoot two things at once, look, either side. Um, I don't think that was his intention, but... Yeah, it's a kind of cool little feature. Not that we'll ever be doing that, probably because that would be hard to set up but anyway yeah this is a frigate and it's got loads of like doorways and things like in here there was some attachment winches and things but I took them out um, from the side here because that they weren't needed but it's really cool loads of doors so like we can yeah curls can get in and out of the sides here uh, a nice engine cluster at the bottom and also cargo doors. He did have some recovery ships docked but um, on the sides but because they used the winch they didn't have enough power so I've kind of modified it a bit. I've got a winch up here and these are two landers like invader landers and in here Sean you wanted to be you wanted a kind of frigate with a lander a delta lander so yeah you'll be going down so these guys um, I've also got 
Matt is, Matt is. He wanted to be on the Minmus side, I think. So what I'm going to do is he's going to be a traitor. He's going to actually um, land on Minmus and then become a Minmonian and fight for them and give them intelligence from the enemy side. And I've already got you down, Aragon, but because you made this ship, I've put you in as Aragon Foxtrot again, and you can pilot this, because it is your creation. And it's a pretty darn cool ship. <clears throat> Apart from the fact you didn't connect the engines to the fuel. So, I actually have to cheat to fly this. I could have sorted it out, but it would have been too much tinkering, and he'd done a, he worked a long time getting all this set up, so... I'm just going to have to fly it with infinite fuel on. But it does handle really well. So yeah, we've got two landers in here. Um, we've got a little docking port, so this can be reused for other things too. And this, if this survives, this will be going back to Juna as well. Because I really like this. I want to use this quite a bit. So yeah, Sean, you're in this door. Once we're over at Minmus, um, I'll get you out. And Matt is Matt. You two will go and land. Uh, I've got the Quantum Strut mod again, which I haven't used for a while, so I can turn it off and on, look, so now they're wobbly, and now they're strong, so yeah, so it helps, so when we're doing, you know, travelling with things docked, I can hold them in place, which is a really, really cool mod to have, and the lights obviously turn off and on. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, there's door in here as well. There's doors everywhere on this thing. It's quite crazy. And I'm surprised it actually flies relatively uh, smooth. And we've got a nice little bay window here. Observatory. But anyway, I'm going to actually launch this. Um, I'm going to speed this up. And then, yeah. Uh, Sean, you're going to go and try and infiltrate some of the enemy weapons. Or the Minmonians weapons, the Minmus people. I don't know, they're obviously your enemy, so yeah. You'll be you'll be an infiltrator. So you'll go down, I'll rename this like a Delta. Once I've undocked it, otherwise it'll rename the whole ship. But this is the Foxtrot Eagle uh, class frigate. <laughs> so yeah, Foxtrot Eagle class frigate, that's what it's called. And that's pretty much all I've got to say. So let's fly this. Unfortunately, I do have to cheat though with the infinite fuel, but I don't want the unbreakable stuff on because I don't need that. Also, the RCS is put like hardly any on here. So yeah, I didn't want to add loads of parts to it as well because I want to keep it smooth and it's actually pretty good with frames as it is. So yeah. So I'll see you guys over at Minmus. What I'll do is get into a Minmus orbit like fairly low deploy these, land them, and then send this over, because this is the defender of the Dershant mothership, the DMS, like the main control hub. I was going to put some weapons in it, but I thought the landers would be cool. And that's Sean, Sean Lee, Sean Lee, or Sean Lee, hi, Lee, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Yeah, he wanted to have a lander, so I thought I'd create it. Anyway, I'll see you over at Minmus, and then, yeah, I'll see what happens from there. So let me just shut the door, and then get rid of that. But yeah, I can actually launch this, by the way, with a launch stage, but um, it's easy. I have actually done it. But because, yeah, save on frames and make it smoother for me, I'm just going to launch it as is. Turn them off and turn the lights off. A couple of extra frames. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, that's it. Enjoy the launch and everything, and I'll see you over at Mimus.
Um, <laughs> I kind of think I killed you, Sean. Something exploded, and I'm pretty sure it was the uh, control pod for this, <laughs> which you were in. So this is like just floating around. And yeah, I think I have to replace you. Oopsie daisy. Yeah, the thing is, like these these things rotate crazy unless you extend their legs. Um, I should have really just got you out before extending the legs. But Matt is Matt is O one. Seems to be okay. Oh, the whole. The whole pod came out. Whoops. <laughs> oh god. Alright, never mind, whatever. So uh, I'm I'm gonna have to fix a few things I guess. Um including resending that thing. The uh the eagle frigate. I need to do some tweaks. But my bad. Anyway, let's get one of you down at least. So, let's speed this up. I'm not even sure where you are. You're there. Let's get you round. And then I'll take the... I'm actually going to crash the frigate because... Yeah, I need a new one. Because I messed up with the docking ports. Okay, so let's see. I'm actually going to take the infinite fuel off this now. And the RCS. So this is natural. It's only for the frigate I needed it, so let's see what this thing can do. So let's just land you somewhere over there. Maybe a little bit further. Around there. But yeah, we don't need RCS anyway, this thing's so nimble. RCS is only for docking and this doesn't even have a docking port anymore, so let's just do this. Uh I need to see how much fuel we're going to need. I also need to engage this engine. How much do we need? Not a lot, cool. Okay, so let's float around. <laughs> I've gone way past now, whoops. But it doesn't matter. Let's put them markers on a sec. Okay, that's good enough. So now let's try to get you down. This has got plenty of fuel, it should be fine. With these little engines, they're pretty cool. So you're the infiltrator. No you're not, sorry, you're actually going to be a traitor. You're going to turn good, because you wanted to be on the good side. But I thought I'd send you over. But yeah, I kind of messed up quite a bit like this episode. First I crashed the... Uh, Salvation 2 and then yeah I kind of killed someone and messed up the whole docking port system I wonder how fast this thing can kill speed yeah, that's good enough ah, I forgot to take off that stupid maneuver node never mind yeah this thing's cool these are quite sweet little landers actually what the hell? Oh, sorry. I thought I um, cut the engine, but obviously I didn't. So now I need to <laughs> go back down. If I do it. Yeah, there. Because then we can go in the right direction. Let's go over a little bit. Okay, that'll do. Anyway, let me just quickly just plonk that there get rid of this silly manoeuvre node because it annoys me yeah, this has been a bit of a fail uh, and I want free camera because that's annoying so don't worry I'm still just waiting for um, everyone to kind of put some input in for the actual war and I thought I'd get the last couple of people over even though I've killed one of them already but like King Toby you'll be resurrected for the war but at least you made it into an episode. 
You were you're a hero. You went out like a hero. This thing's so nimble. Do do but they're cool little landers, cute. I should make a ship with like fifty of them or something. In one massive frigate, that'd be cool. And probably break my computer at the same time. Yeah, I can speed this up. Okay. The SAS is useless on this thing. Okay, I think we should start throttling a bit. God damn it, this thing's so nimble. Just want to get that dead on the top and then try and get this close enough, that'll do. Okay, time to do the old shadow shadow landing. The blind landing. So easy on me, must say. And just Plop. Sweet. So there you go, Matt, you traitor. <laughs> You're down. And someone would come and talk to you. You, you would just pretend that you were a spy and they knew you were coming. So someone would come and collect you soon. You can see over the sky, like, random ships flying over. What's that? Oh, that's the tiger. That's actually going to be crashed this episode. Which I'm going to go and do now. Quickly. And that'll be the end of the episode. Where is it? There. If I click enough times, <laughs> I'll get to it. Come on. There you go. I'll probably on something completely different. Nope. See, uh, oh no, the docking ports are okay. Okay, I can keep this then. So it won't be crashed. But I do need to get it over to let's close these doors see nothing's wrong with this is it seems okay good shape I just need to replace Sean god rest his soul oh yeah I forgot I didn't have this on I need these on for this ship unfortunately okay so I am going to maneuver this to here where are we we're here so I need to do this first, the descending node, so that'll be the north. Yeah, I'll speed all this up and then I'll just park it up fairly close. Okay guys, so Sean died and uh, Matt is Matt is 01 is down back with his Minmonians because he was a spy. And we are on the same orbit as the DMS mothership. So this ship's going to protect the DMS with the lasers and whatnot. And it's not totally broken. Still got both docking ports inside, so I'm not sure what's going on with the uh Yeah, with the other thing. But never mind. All good. So that's pretty much it for this episode. Close that back up. So we've got a cool little frigate now enemy frigate. Um, I don't really want to blow this up because I want to take this to Juno. Although I might tweak it and get the fuel working and things so I don't have to cheat to um, use it. It's a pretty darn nice ship. And yeah, can I switch now? Yeah, I didn't want to rendezvous totally because obviously we'd um, get very much laggy because that DMS is like 250 parts and this is like 140 or something like that. So that would be Lag City over there. Um, yeah, and like I said, I'm not sure how much I've edited this up, but uh, this is just another little preparation episode while I'm waiting for everyone to choose what side they want to be on still. And if, like, 
it takes too long. I'll wait another day and then if not I'll just kind of do it myself, pick people to use. I know a lot of people have chose already which is good. <laughs> 